Is it possible to overcome alcohol addiction and completely rewire your neural pathway? My name is Cody, I'm a recovery specialist for Beyond Sober, and today we're gonna to talk about the science of recovery, specifically why some people struggle to evolve past their addiction. And you may have heard of something called the pink cloud. For some, the recovery process can be extremely challenging because of deeply ingrained neural processes that keep them trapped in an addiction. And this is the result of the brain's inability to create new neural pathways. Nerve damage, brain fog, high tolerance all contribute to the reasons why it's difficult to recover. This ability is absolutely essential for breaking a physical addiction, emotional dependency, or becoming an ex-alcoholic. Did you know there's more ex-alcoholics on the planet than there are real alcoholics? Your brain is designed to follow familiar patterns, and breaking free from those patterns takes a very conscious effort. Sobriety is simply taking a break from the toxicity, and that is not enough to rewire the brain. You might feel a bit better, but what you do with that feeling determines whether or not you're going to recover. To truly transform, we need to engage in intentional practice and embrace the power of imagination. That quantum computer that's stuck within your skull, you're allowed to think about whatever you want especially if those things move you forward. Now, the pink cloud is this interesting phenomenon where people feel overly confident after taking a break from alcohol. I feel so good, good enough to drink. This is where people find themselves lapsing in their sobriety. A lapse in your sobriety isn't the same as a relapse in an addiction. And this is why certain programs relapse rate is so high. You're the exact same person simply taking a break. Some people call that a dry drunk. And this is why it's absolutely crucial to focus on the root cause of dependency and rewire the brain for lasting change. You must evolve into becoming a healthier person by putting your energy into recovery. And the key to recovery lies in creating new neural pathways. It's not about saying no to alcohol. It's about saying yes to water. I know this because I am an ex-alcoholic and a liver failure survivor. In order to become this person, I had to break free from all of the neurological conditions that made me an addict. And by using basic techniques like mindfulness, meditation, imagination, you can get clear on exactly what the healthiest version of you looks like. If your beautiful brain doesn't know what it's working towards, then it's just gonna go back to firing all those familiar signals. And as you practice these techniques, your brain does what it's designed to do best. Rewire itself and break free from old patterns and create new healthy connections. You are not your circumstances and don't let your past define your future. Remember, change is possible and you have the power to completely shape your destiny. If you could use my support, you know where to find me.